So food's not considered a high risk touch point. Number one, because the virus itself, although has really good stability on hard surfaces like plastic and like um, stainless steel, a, a, a biological surface like a food isn't really great for that virus survival. So even if we look at the research on coronaviruses or other respiratory viruses over time on food, if we can look for it, find it there, or even place it on there, um, over time, it, the, the surface just doesn't support the viability of, of that virus. The other big reason for food not being um, a, a focus for us in, as a transmission route is that the consumption of food, as we think about how we eat food, if there was a virus on that food, it's gonna go into our stomach and the, the virus, this virus, COVID-19, really needs to be in respiratory cells. It needs to hit the right types of cells for infection. And, and again, it's not to say that this is not impossible. It is possible. It's just very, 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 very unlikely and a low risk place for transmission of, of viruses. As that uh, food gets consumed, uh, the cells that the food goes through, whether it be the esophagus, into the stomach, um, into the intestines, are just not the right cells that we see for the majority of the illnesses. And that's really why CDC um, and USDA have really not identified food, consumption of food as a risk factor for transmission of the virus and for illness resulting from the virus. As a, as a shopper, is that when I go home, as I've been in, in public, as I might be exposed to, to individuals who do have the virus and, and may be transmitting it um, because of, of symptoms, um, I, I'm then as soon as I go home, I'm washing my hands again. As I'm putting my groceries away, I'm actually doing the exact same step after everything's in my pantry. I'm washing my hands using hand sanitizer. And um, so one step that that we may not have talked about so much yet, but as I'm using packaged foods, as I'm using anything that I've purchased, I'm also washing my hands after meal preparation, after uh, opening up those uh, those packages, just to break the transmission potential all throughout my my food preparation as well. 